Okay. Brains. Here's his little beach front with his little beach umbrellas. First thing you see. Yeah, with this world portal mod, you can set up a portal. Please do not chop down my trees near my house, thanks. Yeah, here's his little house. A two-story affair. This is just the beginning of his, uh... Right click a bone on a dog. I tried that. Only worked with the pork chop. Sometimes... It... Sometimes it makes up to three bones. It takes up to three bones. I was trying to leave a sign to explain to him how to tame a dog. And apparently he couldn't oh, get it. Oh, Dad, to work. ultra leg. Look. Yeah. Dave's apparently been mining. Look at this. 64 stacks of iron. Six diamonds and eye of ender. Yeah, he's uh he's been going all out. Gold sword, iron sword. Not going to steal any of his stuff, of course. Here's his little bedroom. Now let's give a tour of his little island. He's uh he's actually done quite a bit of work in this. Dad, but I'm lagging hardcore. Look, look at his um field. Yeah, he hasn't really checked his crops yet. He's got a lily pad in the middle. Um, he's got a nine by nine square of of crops. Okay, close. There you go. This is so he can find his way home, no matter how far he wanders. Uh, Dave's booze factory. Yeah, bunch of cows in a pit. Where? Can't you hear the cows moving? And well, I see, I see these cows, but where are you? I'm just walking down this road here. He built this bridge over top of this uh, chasm. He has a Dad, chasm. Dad, I don't know where the heck you are. Okay, just wait there for me. I'll be back. He's got another bridge here, sort of diagonal-like. Then it goes off. This road, I believe, goes nowhere, but this one leads to... Hey, Dad, I see you. ...another part of his Hey, map. a bridge! Yeah. Dad, there's a wolf down there. There's a few wolves. Whoa! Oh, yeah, this road, it goes down into the chasm, but there's nothing really down there. It's more of a sightseeing tour, I guess, which we're not going to take. We all know what chasms look like. Um... So we'll go back this way, and he has a road branching off here. Dad, I tamed a dog. Uh, you don't need a dog in Uncle Dave's world. So? So? I want a dog. Oh, he built Where himself some you? kind of lighthouse tower. I'm just walking down this road. Okay, let's go down these stairs and see what's here. Alrighty. Where the heck are you? Little bridge. See, he, di he did all this. He just comes home from work and he's all tired and he logs on to oh. Minecraft and he just sits there building. Dad, it's been 40 minutes. Yeah, well, we haven't finished our tours yet. Um, yeah, he just built a bunch of uh, random little houses just for the sake of building, I guess, because he doesn't use them all. He just builds a house and then walks around and builds something else. I'm going to show you his uh, his brewing establishment. Yeah. Oh, Andre left. I lagged off the game. Here is a tree we grew. We stuck n a 9x9 nine nine square of saplings and it's like the fattest tree in the history of Minecraft, I think. Biggest one I've ever seen anyway. Pretty cool. Uh, he's got some Temporary storage here, I believe, just while he was building. And uh, let's take a look at his brewing station. It's all flooded with water all around this tunnel. You click the portal, and you're on the second floor. There's no exit other than the portal. Brewing stand, cauldron, all his ingredients. Apparently someone used creative mode to get all that. There's no way he would have had all that. And here's where he scoops water out with for his bucket, for his cauldron, and off we go. Cute little brewing stand, and there's a chalet over there. We'll go check out that, and then we'll check out the mountain top, and then we'll uh, head out of here. Are you coming back in, boy? Back in where? Where are you? 
I'm at the beach. I'm lagging. That's kind of cool. Look at the ceiling he built. Wooden glass. Interesting. It looks like some kind of a temple or something. Little gravel pathway. And beyond this is all just woods as far as I know. There's more stuff on those hilltops over there. Here's a nice little Dad, counter. my game is lagging so hard. Okay, just just watch my screen and make any comments you want to make. Here's another attic. He's got high ceilings in this one. I kind of like it. There's the other side of the chimney. Here's the uh, second floor of the fireplace. Which Dad, is can I up. exit while you finish the tour? Sure, if you want. Just come sit by me and comment on my game. Just don't yank your cord out of the computer. That looks like a Space Invaders pattern. Okay, we're going to run over up the hill. Well, him. Show well, he is. Yeah. Not me. Lord Kevnar is the avatar. He's got a little uh, fire going on top of that pillar. It's kind of cool. Yeah, so Uncle Dave built all this stuff over the past many weeks. He's got a second floor. I think Ashley helped him with some of it. He built a little shack here for some reason. I tried to make the jump and failed. Because he didn't actually run. Oh, the hell. oh yeah, this is the other thing Uncle Dave does. He makes mines everywhere. Everywhere you go, there's little mines going down into the bowels of the earth. This is another one, I bet. He's got them all over the place. Fell in a hole, got a booter. Another mine. But we're going up this hill here to see what we can see. To see what we can see. See what we can see. But all that he could see. But all that he could see. Oh, hunger. Oh, Nothing oh. much... Nothing mushroom stew can't handle. Nothing a little mushroom stew can't fix. It sounds like he just has a big burp at the end of eating a bowl of stew. Okay, that should that should do it. Hey, look! What? A wrecked bridge. Yeah. Okay, this goes back to the main village again. At uh, this little road here. This semi-decayed bridge. Looks like the handiwork of Lord Kevnar, that bridge. Here's a... The road continues up to the temple on the hill. And this is a decayed... What does it say? Morgadale Infirmary. Let healing water flow. Oh, see? Cool cobwebs. It looks abandoned. There's a tree growing out of the floor. It looks weathered and storied. It used to be an infirmary back in the days of the wars, but now it's just an abandoned building. Daddy, you know how to make Lego quicks? I mean, um, Minecraft quicksand. The water comes out the bottom, flows down here, down into this little ravine here. Daddy, you know how to make Minecraft quicksand? Uh, no, I don't. Well, it's basically just cobweb. Oh yeah, okay, I guess that would work. Because you sink in cobweb. And then you'd slowly die of starvation. Because you wouldn't be able to get out unless you broke out. Which some people can't do. And I think that's the end of the tour of Dave's world. He's got a little stone shelter there just to cover up the top of a, another one of his mines. Um, there's a tower, there's the chalet, there's the brewing station. He doesn't really have a, an enchanting library. But I suppose he could make one if he if he ever mustered up the, the gumption to do so. Now we're going to head back to the main portal. Black sheep. Black sheep. Black sheep. Hey, I'm violating the copyright. 
Of uh, Kurt, of Kurt J. Mac. Kurt J. Mac and his Pink Sheep song. Uh, actually, I don't think he made that song. I think one of his viewers made it. Following the road, sun's going down. Here, draw my weapon. Look at the road is all sort of weathered Wrecked. as well. Wrecked. Sort of half decayed. Oh, I wonder what he built off in this direction now. This is new. Oh, no, it's just a dead end. I guess he was just building a sidewalk. He must have future plans for this part. But um, this is pretty much the only person who's... Well, Ashley sort of built up her world a little bit too, but... Um, I built up my world a tiny bit. There's not much to see. We'll, we'll uh, take a quick peek over there. Yeah, I built up my world a tiny bit too, but uh, I've mostly been building in other people's worlds. So. Hello, dog. That's mine. Get off the pressure plate, dog. I'm holding the gate open. Oh yeah, he also has some trails of torches going off in that direction. I think he was just exploring and he left the trail. Okay, here we go back to Skull Island. We're back on the main plaza here. Um, Ashley World. I'll take a, uh, take a fast peek. She did. Oh, we're on top of her house. Okay. <coughs> and all her buildings is over in this direction. She has a tree house. Oh yeah, Caitlin built a tree house too in her world. But we're not gonna take a look at that. Yeah. Uh, she hasn't built much. She doesn't go on very much. But, um, <sighs> Ashley's, Sorry. Ashley's got a little bit of a town here. Doesn't Ashley have, like, a, um, a village? A NPC village? Uh, she has one somewhere. Oh, the skeleton shot the zombie. Look at the mobs around here. Okay, we'll if check out her. If you can live. I'm getting skeleton shot by all sides here. Look at them all. What the? Gives a literal meaning to the word mobs. Okay, okay. Dad. Do you think we should... Um, Dad, you said you were going to take a peek. Yeah, well, I'm just going to show off her... Uh, Ashley's House of Magic. Welcome. She has an enchanting altar, instructions, because she was kind of a noob at enchanting, and she has a uh, brewing stand, same thing, potions and stuff in here, and she doesn't really use it much that I know of, but uh, oh yeah, she also built a tower into the sky that uh, you can fall off of if you so desire. And her friend Megan logged on to Uncle Dave's account and sort of built a ramshackle little strange little house here. Yeah, pick up the items of the mobs. Oh, there's so many mobs I don't even need to. <coughs> Oh, and she has a jobs board here. Ashley and Megan, tool maker, miner. Okay. And she has a couple of buildings over there. But it's just sort of... I think she was watching our Let's Play on our island. And she just copied what we built with our, uh, with our marketplace and our armory. She has the exact same stuff. Just gonna exit out of here, and that pretty much ends the tour. It's so convenient with the portal, hey okay, boy. Yeah. We're not on a bu craft bucket server, so we can add portals into our game. Maybe it's too convenient. It's almost like cheating. You don't have to walk through the jungles, and you don't have to build roads or ladders or stairs you can just portal to wherever you need to go 
Here we are back at her, her original house that she built. So anyway, I hope you've all uh, liked our little tour. We will continue our actual building our world next time. Here we are in back at the plaza. In episode 10. In episode 10, episode 9, we're going to call this episode the... The vacation. Yeah, how about that? We took a little vacation from our world just to show what we're doing when we're not let's play. Um, and there's not going to be parts in this video. Uh, yeah, we might skip over a few few scenes in the editing. Okay, let's go back to Happy, Happy. Island where we started. Yay! Happy Island! And here's where it all started. There used to be a big jungle here when we first logged. Oh, look at the mobs. It's like an arena. Can I prevail against the mobs? Gladiator fighting with a volcano in the back. I really should light up this plaza so there's not... Oh, look at me. I lose a single heart. Take that, ye mobs. Oh, there's more. Okay, I prevailed. New moon setting. Look at an exclamation point in the sky. And the volcano hasn't loaded yet. Let me stand still. Anyway, so this is our... Um, <coughs> hi, Mr. Zombie. Wow, knockback. <coughs> Bye. Ping pong ping. Ting tang ting. I don't know what this platform is doing in the sky, but um, I'm going to go inside. Oh yeah, I think maybe uh, an Enderman pulled that off the roof. Okay, so we're going to end off episode 9, the little vacation tour of Happy Island and Skull Island. See you next time. Andre logged out because he was... Uh, lagging. But, um, okay. Goodbye, everybody. See you next time.